Okay, hey guys, and welcome to Plant Based Homestead Prepper where we make prepping fun. In this video, in this video, we're gonna walk around a store named Ollie's, 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 <laughs> and we're gonna find many, many preps. So, also in this video, we're gonna show how I decided to get Jennifer a new heater so she wouldn't be cold. So, stay tuned and make sure you watch the video. Take care. Hey guys, it's Jennifer Chappelle with Heart Speak Warriors Forum. I hope you're enjoying all of the edutainment that you're getting right here on Plant Based Homestead Prepper with my honey, Roderick Chappelle. When you're done, pop over to my channel at Heart Speak Warriors Forum, where we will take ordinary people and listen to their extraordinary stories. Hope to see you guys there. Hey guys, this is Plant Based Homestead Prepper. And I am enjoying Breakout from the Prison Planet just like you are. So what I need you to do is subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hey everybody, welcome to Heart Speak Warrior Farm. I have Jennifer right here with me. Isn't it amazing how she's doing a video? But she's right here with me. So what I want you guys to do, come check out Plant Based Homestead Prepper when you finish. Keep watching Heart Speak Warrior Farm. But subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. To both channels. Hi, I'm Christina, and you are watching Plant-Based Homestead Prepper. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. All right, guys, Jennifer doesn't know, but I am about to get her a, uh, anyway, I'm about to get this for her for two reasons. One, we still don't have heat. Cause I just haven't gotten it fixed yet. And two, I think it's cute. Don't y'all think that'll be nice? It's almost like a little fire. So it's almost like a little mini fireplace. So anyway, the place I'm at, we're gonna walk around. We'll see if we can find any preps. This is more of a like hardware type store. Um, they do have some food here, but we're gonna walk around and just see what they have to offer. Because you can find preps any and everywhere. Look, bam, there you go. Uh, a $15 sleeping bag, okay? Actually, $16. Boom. That's something awesome. What does this do here? Okay, a trail camera. Some sale for 40 bucks. So it's a good way to keep some surveillance going on. Plenty of doggone things to keep you occupied. Baseballs, things of that sort. Uh, jump rope, that'd be great. After the collapse, you can always do some jump roping. I said I was gonna get back into golfing. Oh gosh, it's uh oh those are top flight. Wow, Let's see here, ten bucks for. That's pretty good buy. And I don't have any golf balls, but it's too cold now, so I'm probably not gonna go out there and hit or play. It's just ten dollars I can spend somewhere else. All right, uh, some bottles. All right, let's continue. Let's see. Car stuff. What is this? Is this a dehydrator? That's exactly what this is. Wow, it's a nine tray dehydrator. Look at there. Now that's something, that's something you can go with right there, folks. I may be coming back trying to get one of these. I've been looking for one that was uh, several trays. This is called a Chefman. Sell, the sales price is 99 bucks. So there you have it. I'll do some research on it. I'll see what they sell for online. And if this is a good deal and it's got good reviews, I may be coming back getting this. See, there you go. That's a great prep item. All right, let's continue. All right, let's see what's, what's cost here. Well, that's not bad. Three dollars and some change. We've changed our um, detergent. I started ordering it from my daughter. Now she has a, she has her own home-based business. So I started ordering our detergent from her. And if anybody is interested in that, it's organic-y uh, type stuff. All right. So here's another prep item. Look at here. Gloves. You guys know I love gloves. That's not a bad price. Two dollars for those. Four dollars for some Stanleys. You're gonna need gloves, okay? So 
stock up, stock up, stock up. And these are pretty good. These are pretty good priced. Three bucks. Here's some raw hat, cow hat ones. Seven bucks. So you can't go wrong with gloves. Right, let's move on. Okay, here's another prep item that I talk about. Zip ties. Zip ties are going to be worth their weight in gold. Because you can always just put fasten things together with some zip ties. Angle irons, uh, brackets, yep, bill shells, little hooks that you can put into your into your shed, save, save space. All right, let's move on, let's keep going. And you know one thing that Jennifer wants me to do is change the carpet out at our house, so I'm gonna check out the carpet All right, uh, section, but it's not gonna be carpet. I've always wanted this game right here, but I've never played it. There's a chest set down here. That's this. This is kind of chest set you want. You don't want this glass stuff. You can't even tell the pieces apart. Old wooden little bitty pieces. This this is what you're looking for. Eight bucks. That's not bad. That's gonna provide several hours of good good fun. Keep your mind right too. All right. So let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's keep it moving. Okay. So stuff like this. This is what Jennifer and I used and the kids used to do right here. We used to shoot each other with the little darts. <laughs> okay, buy Nerf out. Cool. I don't see a, So the little one up there is $2. That one's 13 And of course, we're playing... We're playing Christmas carols already. It's not even Thanksgiving yet. So I'm going to come here anyway. Okay, we're going to go down this aisle just to check prices. Dollar ninety nine, two twenty nine, dollar eighty nine for cocoa pebbles. All right. Now these are pretty good um, items. You use the seeds around Christmas, but those tins. Uh, once you get finished eating whatever's in here, you can use this as a little small Faraday cage. All right. You can use this as a Faraday cage. These also, all these little tins and stuff. Great prep alert, okay? Y'all remember that prep alert. Put your put your electronics in there, and if we have a EMP or if we have a solar flare that takes everything out, your stuff still may be working. All right, so let's go over here and check. Let's see what the flooring looks like. This is what Jennifer wants. Is this lamp? Is this pillar stick? Oh wow. Um, I can't really tell what that is. It's planking flooring. Oh, sorry, ladies. There you go. Alright, so dollar eighty-nine per square foot, which is who knows. I have to sit over here and do some math here real good if I was gonna do this. That's pretty, I like that. So let's see here. This is plank flooring. 18 per square foot per K. 18 square feet. So per case. See, it's too much math when it goes along with these floors. 100% waterproof though. That's not bad at all. I'll probably show Jennifer the video and say, hey babe, was this the color you were talking about? <laughs> this is not bad either. I like this color. But we're definitely going to do our two bedrooms uh, before we get our renters in. So anyway, stay with me. Alright, so another prep alert. <clears throat> Can always stock up on sunflower seeds those things are gonna last forever peanuts you know that stuff is gonna just last okay and of course warm gear warm gear is going to be worth its weight in gold okay stuff like this that's gonna keep you warm when you're outside working and that stuff is only 50 bucks okay so for some coveralls now these are some casual no these are coveralls still 
flame resistant workwear. Okay, there you go. So stuff like this, stuff that you can work in, okay, boots. Don't really know about these boots. So something like this though. That that's good for ladies. This kind of stuff is gonna be worth its weight in gold, you know, hats, and of course socks. So stock up, stock up, stock up. You can't the the, the items that I that I say prep alert on, you can't have too much of them, okay? All right, just remember that. Especially when it comes to socks. <laughs> All right, thank you. Welcome to Plant Based Homestead Prepper. I am Grim from Grim Survival, where we talk about SHTF scenarios, food shortages, things I see while driving this thing, and solar minimums, among many other things. But back to your regular scheduled program. Cue the intro. All right, hey guys, we want to come in and we wanted to recognize. Paul and Adrian over at Off Grid Desert Farming with Paul and Adrian. We absolutely love this couple. They are wonderful folks. They teach you about farming and gardening in the desert. They are totally off grid, totally self sustainable. Uh, I don't even know how they're doing it, to be honest with you. I mean, I know they, they're doing some solar, they have some generator or whatever, but they teach you how to garden and farm in the desert. So go check out Off Grid Desert Farmer with Paul and Adrian. Thanks a bunch. <laughs> All right, so I just decided to come down this aisle. Just look at the toys. Always going to be a kid at heart. Okay. Always love to look at toys. Just to see what kids are getting now. Have y'all noticed that toys are so more, so much more, that's probably not the white way to see it, M better. <laughs> toys are much better now for kids. This is cool. Now, this is something I would love to have right here. Five Power Series TBF Avengers. Okay, so this is the model you have to build, apparently. It's only five bucks, but I'm not going to do anything like that. Here's another one. This is a XF-88 Voodoo. It's an Air Force plane, apparently. Uh, here's a little toy plane. It actually flies, apparently, with the rubber band. Yep, it flies. Uh, let's see what else. Some educational stuff. That's the kind of stuff I used to buy, like to buy my kids. Yes, this Manchester. Interesting. A light cruiser. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Is that, what's that? Oh, I thought that was the Titanic. The unsinkable ship. You gotta be careful what you say. You say something's unsinkable, boy, oh boy. Then we find out the hard way. Hmm. So anyway, um, I don't see any preps on here, on this aisle. This is just more fun than anything. All right, so let's continue. If you haven't subscribed to Plant Based Homestead Prepper yet, please do that now. After the video, come on by Grim Survival, where I will show you the grim side of survival, including actual footage of how bad the harvest season has been this year. All right, so we'll continue, and the closer we get to Christmas, the more you're going to be bombarded with stuff. And that's a cool little doohickey right there. It's a call a space projector. Hmm. I love those toys that keep kids engaged and teach them something. Okay. Um, I want to go off in there just to see, but it's just too much stuff. Okay, so they have a huge. I'm, I'm at old Ollie's old, or, or whatever it's called. Uh, they have a huge like selection of books. I mean, huge. So, great place to go if you want to get some books and stuff. All right, let me see here. The line is so long, I don't even want to go check out now. I want to drop my stuff right here and just leave. So, anyway, thank y'all for watching. Watch our two buddies. Oh. All right, that's just a little peek inside of our lives of us being very silly. At times, Jennifer has a song she's gonna debut right now. Y'all ready? Welcome to Plant Based Homestead Prepper. Plant Based Homestead Prepper. Plant Based Homestead Prepper. I'm Roger Chappelle. Oh. <laughs> and this is why we don't let her do any intros or outros. Where we make prepping fun. Where we make prepping fun. 
Welcome to Plant Based Homestead Pepper, 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 Pepper. <laughs> and yes, we still have lights. We're still on the grid. Plant -based and right behind me is like five dogs. <laughs> Thank y'all for watching. We'll see you guys on the next one. Y'all take care. Right, let's go over and let's see what's going on. Y'all need to be. You need to be very quiet while Artis <laughs> are doing dynamite. <laughs> so when they come in, the next customer's gonna see the manager special. They think they're coming to order pizza, but the manager special is Jennifer and I don't know who these people are supposed to be. I hope that's not supposed to be me. Cause that's definitely not her. Cause her her is her 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 hair is not like that. Okay, so apparently this is a I'm gonna try to zoom in so y'all can see this beautiful. Let's zoom out a little bit. Alrighty, it's ready. They trying to kick us out of here. <laughs> they like, hurry up, get them out of here, cause they're painting on the wall and stuff. Y'all see this beautifulness? You want to take a picture with your artwork, honey? Sure. All right, come do it. And you too could take a picture with of this special artwork if you were in Portsmouth right now. All right, guys, <clears throat> that concludes this video. Thank you so much for being here. Make sure you check out all of our uh, two buddies, our friends and our partners, our two partners. And make sure you subscribe, like, comment. And if you really like it, how about you share it on your social media for us to help us grow. Uh, we are right now approaching 50,000 views. We just went over 240,000 watch minutes. And we need some help getting subscribers because we need another 500. So we need your help, guys. And thank you so very much for being here. We appreciate you. And as always, we're sending you love. All right, take care.